I'm Louisa Hemacek from the Nuke Info Pro Project in uh, the Northwest. And um, my friend Lonnie and I have been discussing how people don't uh, pay attention to the news and they take the news bits. And um, uh, then we've also been hearing that people after Fukushima started getting their own Geiger counters and started measuring all around and that they're getting cheaper and cheaper. And um, they found all kinds of things that they didn't even know about that were radioactive that didn't even come from Fukushima. And um, so uh, some people think Geiger counters are just for uh, scientists and that we should get our information from them. And um, so it brought me to this thing of like, well, let's be aware all the time so we can make our choices. Do we, are we okay with a certain amount of radiation? Um, like, here's Lonnie's Geiger counter. And I hear it going beep. Once in a while. How much is it? And What's it say? saying 18 CPM. That's inside my house. Counts oh, per 13 minute. 13 counts per minute. 13. Inside my house. Before Fukushima, 10 was considered, above 10 was considered unsafe. That's okay. the changes that they made. So, post. This is the age of fission. This is the age of fission now. Okay. We are required to live in radiation, period. Too okay. fucking bad. Get over it. All right. So, I'm not going to get over it, and I think I want to have... <laughs> Me either. Um, okay, here's some good graphics. Oh, yes. Look, the United Louisa States, is a great artist. Check this out. The United States of Awareness, USA. Let's us be intelligent here. We're supposedly intelligent in America and informed, and we have news. Well, let's create our own news, and let's put in some reports if we find anything radioactive. Let's learn how to use Geiger counters, the differences of radiation, so we don't get unscientific and freak out, and then nobody will worry about what we say because it'll sound like bunk. And so, and just be aware of your own environment and hold your um, criteria high uh, for your family and anybody you love. Let's be the United States of Awareness um, and teach others, since we're so honored to have technology and things that some other people can't afford in other countries and in this country, whoever has it, um, learn how to use it and be your neighborhood Geiger counter user. Teach your neighbors how to do it. If you want a cheap one, you can get a Geiger counter kit online. Just Google it, Geiger counter kits, and there's a you can learn how to solder it together.